It's the right thing to do. Gain 19 more. I'm going to walk around this chicken suit is what I'm going to do. We just have to figure out a compromise. Haven't I compromised enough? Haven't I compromised enough? Don't I say... More quests. More quests. This guy. Uh, Lambert and Pinch need help putting on their play in Brightwall. This sounds like fun. Set target. Glowing trail will now indicate... Well, now direct you to this ch this quest. Would you like to fast travel to the nearest available location for this quest? No. Back. To figure out a way the chickens can get the most out of their lives while still making you feel safe. This chicken suit. I'm going to fight in this chicken suit. I'm going to do everything in this chicken suit. People are going to think I'm nuts. Oh, that's just the crazy prince. Some say he went insane after his brother had his girlfriend killed. And now he wears a chicken suit in honor of the chicken who got away in the rolling credits. The opening credits. Out of the way, sucker. Is this where I played the loot? Yeah, this is it. Oh, man, I want to play again. But I'll play off camera because I already showed that. I will show the... Um, what's this? I'll, I'll show the ironwork stuff. Pie maker. Oh, I want to try that too. Let's try that right now. Can we try that right now in the middle of a quest? Sure we can. Use A, X, and Y to clear all the blocks and build up your gold multiplier. Got it. Okay. Alright. Okay. Next round begins shortly. So this is... This is how it's gonna go, huh? Mmm, sublime. <laughs> Man, I'm making pies. I'm just a good pie maker. Hey, Bernard's chickens must love you, saving them from being slaughtered and that. <laughs> I love how people talk about like what you've just done and stuff. That's pretty cool touch. And it, this game's getting a bad rap from people in the comment. Well, not all, not most. Most people like it, but some people are saying, "Oh man, this is the worst fable." So far, so good. I love the first one. I liked the second one, and so far, this is about on par with the second one. I would think. Pie of the day, I reckon. Look how much gold I'm making just making pies. I think this YouTube thing. Was the wrong choice, the wrong career. Oh crap! Oh, I wasn't ready. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I dropped your pie. And we're just gonna leave now, cause the people have had enough of me making pies. I do have to do a bunch of that stuff <laughs> off camera though, so that I can make some money. Especially the loot playing now that I've multi or I, I increased the multiplier. The greatest loot player in all the land. What's up, buddy? You, good sir. Find you who seat. live in such a tumultuous epoch. Do you not thirst for the drama and emotion of a properly structured tragic play? Eh. Of course you don't. You want to escape your troubles. You want to be made merry. You want to be amused. It is no good. We shall never agree. Ah, if only we could get our hands on Morley's lost play. Morley's lost play, okay. It would solve all our problems. Yes, it is said to bring together the opposites of tragedy and comedy in an exquisite marriage of forms. But marriage. You can find it. Of course. Yes. We beg you, the theater, the muses, the very heart and soul of this town will thank you. Okay, I'll do it. I need your guild seals. Splendid, splendid. You should know we did commission an elderly detective elderly to search detective? the library for clues as to the place whereabouts, but he never returned. Uh -oh. The man's name is Ransom Locke, and he's rather closer to senility than one would like, truth be told. If you come across this gentleman, he may be able to aid you. I believe he is looking for the collected works of the playwright Philip Thmorley as we speak. One can only hope they were not burned when the king closed down the academy and its library. Okay, find Ransom Lock. Uh, am I going to the library again? Man, I spent a lot of time in the library. Let's change clothes. This feels like Can I, I should not be dressed this shop? way. I'm quite certain there is something new in there. I trust you are finding everything all right? Uh, let's get classy. Let's class this place up. <laughs> wow, I can actually... Before all this started, I offered you very nearly the same outfit. I remember as though it was yesterday. Very nearly. You chose it, this is um this is this is something else. 
So can I... How do I... Not... Wear the helmet. Can I just do this? And then undress? Aha! Remove... Head. Yes, there we go. There's the handsome prince that all the ladies in all the land want to get with. My sword looks really awesome now, actually. It's got, like, that little um, curvature. Okay. I totally wasn't giggling under my breath there. You have earned another guild seal. You now have enough to open another chest on the road to rule. Return there now to open it and collect its contents. No, I'm not going to do that. Turn back now, mortal one. What? You don't scare me, guy. Do you see the size of my sword? Stay away from this accursed Only place. death and insanity await you. Oh, there it is. Found it. Wow, this is a pretty easy quest. Don't pick it up. Okay, I won't. Is he pretending to be a ghost? I'm serious. Whoa! You lot just can't leave oh, well maybe enough. Alone. He is a ghost. Of my oh, this is Philip Morley, that's right. This is not the guy. What is with my face? Oh my god, that was weird. Okay. I thought I was supposed to find that ransom ran ran. Listen, you. Something? You're not getting my lost plate. You hear? It's rubbish. Worse than rubbish. I mean, what was I thinking? Mixing tragedy and comedy. I must have been off my rocker. Am I in like an alternate universe now or something? There's the guy, Ransom Locke, right? It would seem, mm -hmm. my dear fellow, you have been apprehended by the ghost of Philip Morley. Now that what? makes us both his captives. Great. I am Ransom Locke. If the name seems familiar, it is because I was once a detective of some renown. And yet, here I am, ready to live out the rest of my days, trapped in a book. So we're in the book. As far as I okay. can deduce, we are currently in a scene from one of Morley's greatest romantic plays, the near tragedy of Oliver and Ethel. I believe if we are to escape, we must act out the scene. Oh. But performing is not one of my talents. I'm great at if it. If I am correct, putting on this costume should set things in motion. Wait. Why do I have to be the girl? Oh, man. I have worn some ridiculous stuff already, and I'm barely into this game. And what do I have to do? Oh my god, I make a terrible looking woman. <laughs> oh. oh, Ethel, my love, my life, my son. If thou wouldst but give me one sign, one gesture that would speak of your affections, then might I think this grey existence worth living. Ah, uh, yes, a classic moment in the play. You are Ethel. The beautiful young daughter of a dung merchant. A dung merchant. Show Oliver that you love him, and we may be able to leave this scene. Oh gosh, what do I have to do? Dude, I don't want to. Oh, all right, I'll declare love, I guess. My heart is yours. <laughs> oh, my what a voice! <laughs> my heart is yours. Let the heavens and the seas, the toads and the eels sing the song in my heart. For she doth love me, and all is well. You could do better than me, we pal. We meet again in the morrow, my little ferret, and elope ah, into the sunset ferret. to live out our days in wondrous joy. A magnificent rendition. That's it? True. I applaud you. Hmm. I see you are gifted with remarkable literary cunning, but can you really comprehend the depths of my work? That we shall see. That... Was that really it? Ah, yes. This is undoubtedly no, a scene no. from one of oh. Molly's earlier, funnier plays, Bloodbath at the Royal Court. Looks like and I'm wearing my chicken suit again. this must be your costume. Yep. The role of, of the course fool is. is one filled with tragic depth. It will require a masterful performance. I'm sure I'll do great in this chicken costume. After all, I am already familiar with the ways of the chicken. 
and all the chickens in all the land love me because I saved them from death. Oh, look, I look like a gangster. With that sit. What fresh insolence is this? Out of my throne, you impertinent buffoon! Stand before your king and do your jester's duty. All right. It's a troublesome time for this court, and my crown grows heavy. So make so me make laugh. Me laugh, or I shall have your head. Okay, declare love or tickle. Oh, I'll tickle. I can't declare love for him. That won't make him laugh. You laughing? Are you laughing? <laughs> Are you laughing? Laugh, damn it. He's smiling. He's smiling at oh Okay, good. No, no, stop. It's too funny. He looked worried there. I believe I'm in the right mood now to meet with those foreign delegates. I think I shall only behead half of them. Yes. What a great decision. You're a good guy. I have never seen a more convincing fool. There is hope for us yet. You handle my royal dramas as well as you handle my romances. But will your versatility extend to the more subtle domains of theater, I wonder? More subtle. What's more subtle? Oh dear. Unless I'm mistaken, this is a scene from Morley's notoriously fight. violent historical epic, Titus the Mutilator, Part 2. Which would mean this is the gladiatorial arena from Act 5. Mm -hmm. Where Titus is finally slaughtered by savage warriors seeking revenge. A favorite scene of mine as a child, I must admit. And here is Titus's famous costume. So... I had some pajamas that looked just like it. Put it on and you will take on the greatest role of your life. So I have to... I have to die in this because the scene is where Titus dies, right? I think that's what he said. Titus, thy pox-membered body shall pay for thy monstrous villainy. My son lies dead because of you. Now shall revenge be mine. Cold is your corpse and all the more flavorsome for it. Do try to make your demise ah, convincing. Okay. So I do have to fight him. I think I'll cut it off you. Def complete the scene by dying or defeating Ace's men? So, okay, let me just let me just go ahead and Oh, look at this. This is going to be amazing. What? Oh my gosh. Oh. That was awesome. Ow, ow. Don't touch me. Be like that, huh? My kin lies slain, and yet you live. You have breathed your last sulfur-scented breath, Titus. Is it just worm on a hook with a fish? More of Ace's men? What are they doing down there? Oh, here they come. I sort of want Ace to kill me, and not these guys. Plus, I keep getting guild seals by just defeating these guys. I'm just gonna sit here and fire some rounds at them. <laughs> you guys suck at fighting. You're not very convincing actors. Oh, there it comes again. That's awesome. Ouch, that hurt, dude. All my men dead. Good, good. My vengeance denied. My world undone. I cannot stand to live one second more. Uh oh. Oh, what scene could possibly follow such a oh. masterful rendition of my work? And the way you improvise some of those roles, you brought new life to okay, my world. Okay, so he likes my improvisation. You have earned the prize no mortal has ever been honored with before. My missing play. I entrust it to you, for I know that you will do it 
justice. I Thanks, guy. The ham sandwich. A metaphorical title, of course. <laughs> what a great title for a comedy. The Ham Sandwich. Ah, you have retrieved our aged investigator. Happy day! Have you perchance found... This is no time for perchances, Lambert. The play, do you have it? Yeah, guys. You saved, Lambert. Oh, the joy in my bosom knows no bounds. Thank you a million times. Thank you. <laughs> His head bosom. It's <laughs> Comedy and tragedy this guy's will hilarious. Let's join hands. <laughs> he said bosom. <laughs> okay. Hark. Bear witness to the tragic futility that is man. Oh, how many people how are watching? Wow, what a crowd. Senses to see paradise and yet to be barred. That reminds me of a great joke. A guard, a monk, and a chicken walk into a bar. Unfortunately, the bartender had had a mild heart attack that morning, so none of them get served. Wow. And yet what purpose doth heartache serve when the infinite dark blanket that is death falls softly upon our still beating corpse? That reminds me of another one. A corpse walks into a bar and says, Can I have a lemonade? Certainly, replied the bartender. I've never seen a stiff drink. And so endeth our happy, sad play. This is a terrible play. We are made of nothing but clay. There's time only for our fool to say... Great big giant bosoms! What Might have been... was that? Biggest load of old tosh I ever saw. It didn't yep. even make sense. Yep. Worst play ever. I totally agree. That was horrible. Well done. You have gathered quite an impressive following in Brightwall. This should be more than enough to convince this little hamlet to send aid so to the dwellers. So, what shall you do now, I believe Samuel Mr. awaits you at the Any town more gates to express on that the very sentiment. I rather think not. Okay, Samuel, at the town gates, we can do that. I gotta come back and play some loot, guys. I can't wait to play some more loot. Can I? Oh, you can't. Can it? You can't roll when you're not attacking. I'd like to just roll through town, like a boss. Hey, my you look quite attractive. Good to me, so I'm good to them. Would you like to hold my hand? I guess not. Oh, she's a housewife. I hope you make them suffer. No, a you're, gang you're, of them did my husband in. I'm not interested in housewives. I'm interested in in hot Hail young ladies. You what is this? Oh, are these all the the, the best shop in Brightwall. Stuff. Look at all these esteemed people. citizens wow. of Brightwall. Today we demonstrate the generous nature of our fair town. For too long have our mountain neighbors suffered in silence. The chickens are here. We extend a helping hand, but this effort would not have been possible without the courage and determination of one man. The son of the old hero king. Yeah, it's me. On this day, we shall know you as the hero of Brightwall. Thank Before you, guys. You, we ask of you one favor. What? As we pledge ourselves to you, so we hope you will pledge to return Brightwall to its former glory and reopen the academy which your father founded. You got it. Pal, I will. Hey, that's me, by the way. <laughs> I hereby promise that I shall reopen the Brightwall Academy, and I signed it. Very cool. Very, very good. Very good. I expected nothing less from you. These volunteers shall carry the supplies to the dweller camp. They may have them with our blessing. I hope you will return one day, not just as our hero, but as our king. Me too, buddy. Look, everybody was wearing hats, but they're still wearing hats. They threw their hats up in the air, yet their hats remained on their head. <laughs> it's magic. Go to the dweller camp. Okay, how many guild seals do I have now? the finest items in Brightwall. You do? What items oh, do you have then? Almost Health anything. potions. 
slow time potion. Can I go to? Upon that wall, you'll find the contracts representing the promises that you've made to the people of Albion. Your contract with Samuel is there, for example. What this one? Ah, yeah. What's this? When someone has given you a gift, hmm? I will keep it for you here until you wish to unwrap it. Did somebody send me a gift or something on? Lionhead Studios. Hunter's Lodge Deed. That appears to be all of the gifts. I got hunter. I got a hunter's lodge. Ah, I, have, loyal I have a lodge. This is where you can see how he is getting on his combat proficiency, any new tricks he's oh, learned. Oh, really? That sort of thing. Oh, look at that! Aggression, two stars, one star exploration, one star charisma. <gasps> I can rename him. Okay, I'm renaming the crap out of him. Um, oh, I have to type it. Okay, hold on a second here. Spot. That's it. That's his name. Spot. That will look nice embroidered on a collar. Won't it? Dig spot. Um, yeah, let's go to the road to rule. I'm going to upgrade some more stuff. So what am I using most? I'm using my sword most. Look at all these people supporting me. Wait, who's this guy? Is this the bright wall guy? I know these two are. Oh, that's the chicken guy. Never mind. Um, okay. Spend guild seals or exit through the portal. So that's open. So level two. Okay, wait a minute. What's this? Upgrade pie maker to level two. You know, um, I wonder if that's. Learn dance, hug, and kiss to become best friends or even lovers of the people of Albion. Also unlocks the friend. Yes! I want to dance, hug, and kiss my way to stardom. I'll take it. What's this one? Unlock marriage, house buying, having children, and adoption. Yes. I want to get married. I want to be the best husband. <laughs> that sounded kind of sad. I want to be the best husband you ever had. Okay, so I have... Ooh. Yeah, I use the gun a lot too, actually. You know, I, I think I use everything pretty evenly, so let's let's go ahead and use up the gun thingy there, which leaves me with 27, is it? Hunter's Lodge, visit your new home. Oh, look at my gun now. That looks a lot better. Can I? Oh, I was standing on that thing. Leave road to rule. I should visit my home, shouldn't I? A ratsicle this guy's having. Sounds sounds great. Hi. So where is my new home? You've done a wonderful thing for those poor people in the mountains. They will be overjoyed when you arrive with the aid that you acquired for them. A caravan of love. Didn't they? Oh, where was that? Where was that home they gave me? What is this? Go to the Dweller Camp, okay. Hunter's... Oh, there it is! There it is! Hunter's Lodge! Visit your new home! I wanna... Yes! Set as target. A glowing trail right here. Would like to fast travel? Yes! We gotta visit our new home. A dig spot! Spot! Spot found a dig spot. Right here. What a good dog. Good spot. Whoa, 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 guys, I'm digging! Guys, guys, guys. 